Six, we're hearing from Providence's mayor ahead of planned raids this weekend by immigration agents in cities across the country. Eyewitness News reporter Anita Buffoni joins us live now with the new details. It, the number Providence of Mayor Jorge Alorza is doubling is down, bad. saying Providence will continue to not cooperate with immigration officials trying to deport undocumented immigrants. They've um, uh, published a name of uh, some major cities. Uh, Providence hasn't been on that list. However, that hasn't stopped people in our community from, from being frightened. This comes after President Trump announced raids to arrest undocumented immigrants that will be carried out this weekend. Immigration and Customs Enforcement agents are expected to target 10 major cities to find undocumented immigrants with final deportation orders, though there are fears that they might deport other people they encounter in their raids. Immigration lawyer Joe Molina Flynn has this advice for immigrants. Don't open the door until you've seen a warrant signed by a judicial officer and don't say anything at all until you've had the opportunity to speak to an immigration um, attorney. But Terry Gorman, head of Rhode Islanders for Immigration Law Enforcement, supports the raids, saying they target people who already have deportation orders. Our court system is nice enough not to lock them up to, to, to just say that you're going to you have to self-deport and leave. And so there's no incarceration in the rest of it. And now they, they defy that also. Now, Mayor Alorza and other Democrats say this move by the Trump administration is a political stunt, but Republicans say it's necessary to protect national and border security. I'm Anita Buffoni, Eyewitness News.